looking forward to Morbius. Um, I didn't. I don't know like a crazy amount about Morbius chat. I just know as much as we learned from the Spider-Man animated series, which I know many of you know, right? Spider-Man, Spider-Man, radio, yeah. So I remember he was on there and he was just a jerk and Spider-Man was just like, Jesus Christ, leave me alone. And he was like, I need the plasma. He had a really cool voice. Um, so the first trailer I thought looked fine. I've heard this trailer looks a little better. So let's check it out. Let's see what we think. Um, and let's just enjoy a few trailers before we get back to James Vega. <laughs> You're a fan of chairs, Rudy? You we're, use them every day? That's fair. And Falky, it's so great to see you, by the way, dude. Oh, I'm so excited for No Way Home. Tell me your crime. I'm so excited. So excited. All right, all right. Morbius first. Let's give him his due. He deserves it. You need a doctor? I am a doctor. I should have died years ago. Jesus. People all over the world have my disease. I'm here. To find a cure, we have to push the boundaries, take the risks. If you're gonna run, do it now. Fan. This is great. Oh, I don't know, T. Michael team. Morbius, you've been missing for two months. When you're a stranger. Then you were found on a container ship that washed up off Long Island. Faces look ugly when you're alone. Johnny! Feels like they're going all in on the war. So, I wish I knew. from dying to being more alive than ever. It worked. Not exactly. I have increased strength and speed. And some yes. form of fat radar. Yes. What else can I do? Oh, his eyes. Oh, Jesus, dude. There are limits. There has to be. There's something inside of me. He wants to hunt and consume blood. Michael. Oh, man. Oh, man. You control it. I don't know. Half the city wants to kill you. We haven't had anything this good since that thing in San Francisco. The other half wants to control you. Hey, uh, Dr. Mike, you and I should stay in touch. I'd do anything to save a life. God, it looks amazing, right? I don't know what I'm capable of. Holy Jesus, it looks amazing! You save lives, you don't take them. Are you here to heal the world? Or to destroy it? Jesus, dude. Oh, Jesus. Who the hell are you, man? I am. I know. I'm just kidding. It's Dr. Michael Morbius at your service. <laughs> okay. Uh, I mean, that looked kind of sick. I, I'll be honest with you, chat. Uh, the first trailer we saw, the first trailer we saw, they, I was like, oh, Morbius looks pretty cool. Like, whatever, right? But the, in my opinion, like, the effects and the CG now, like, it looked incredible, dude. Like, what the F? It looked incredible. Like, I feel like they learned from Nightcrawler and also, of course, you know, Venom and Spider-Man. Uh, I do love the idea that, uh, so, so, chat. This is for Morbius, my lord. So... I know there's been, like, huge discussions about whether this takes place in the Marvel Universe because it's weird, right? Like, that, like it looks like he's talking to Vulture, assuming Michael Keaton is Vulture in this. Now, I can't imagine he wouldn't be, but I don't know. But also, I don't even remember where it was, but 
he walks past the um he walks past the the wall that has like Peter Spider Man it says murderer on it. And so it feels like it takes place in the like far from home universe. Well, you know, the homecoming Spider Man universe. So like I don't know though, because like they've also been like, I don't know. I don't know if it's in there. So like I actually have no idea. All I know is that uh it worked. Not exactly. The effects I look amazing. Increased strength and speed. And some form of bat radar. What else can I do? Like his like just honestly everything about how they're animating him and stuff is sick. There's something inside of it. He wants to hunt and consume blood. Michael. God. His design is incredible, though. And you control. Oh, that's Toby Spider Man. Thank you, NJ. Thank you for correcting me. And that makes it even more interesting. So, is he related to the, like, uni Multiverse of Madness? Yeah, there it is. Hold on, chat. I'm gonna pause it. Yeah, that's definitely, you're right. That's Toby. I recognize the Raimi, Raimi suit. So then, like, yeah, so when the f*** is it? <laughs> when is it? Rhino on the loose. Black cat. This is so interesting. Like, I don't know, man. I mean, I like, I mean, I, you know me, I'm all for mystery, so I don't mind them kind of keeping it close to the vest and us, you know, finding out, but it's intriguing, right? It's like, yeah, yeah, Mondo, they could be Easter eggs. They could be, that's a good point, T. Rhino was in The Amazing Spider Man. Was Rhino in the other movies? In the Sa the Toby movies? I don't think so. I think he was in Amazing Spider-Man 2, right? Yeah. So, huh. Yeah, the second one, Amazing Spider-Man. Right. He was right at the, like, the beginning and then right at the end for like two seconds. Okay. Which I thought was weird, but you know, whatever. Um, what a, maybe, maybe they didn't put it in the universe because even they were confused. They were like, "What the? F uh, everybody, just everybody's here." You know. Of course, you know what they could do, chat. In multiverse of madness, they could basically establish a fusion of different Marvel tracks and then just give us this crazy new world, right? That would be weird. It would also be incredibly bold. Because then it could set up some crazy sh But anyway, it's not important, chat. It's not important. I'm kind of getting into potential TV show spoilers and stuff. But yeah. I'd do anything to save a life. Jesus. I don't know what I'm capable of. Like, that looks so amazing, dude. You save lives. You don't take them. Are you here to heal the world? Or to destroy it? Who the hell are you, man? I am. I know. I'm just kidding. It's Dr. Michael Morbius. Okay. I completely didn't even realize that he literally said, I am Venom. He literally made a reference to Venom chat. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I love, I love this first video. Which Marvel universe does Morbius exist in? Like, who, like, what? He looks amazing, but like, where is he? Like, like, like what? By the way, Chad, if you ever meet somebody and their eyes do that, they have rabies. And you should call, like, somebody. <laughs> like, don't, if you ever see somebody who looks at you and their eyes are doing that, don't, like, don't just, like, talk to them, you know? 
<laughs> like you should call animal control or something cuz uh like pupils can do a lot of weird things especially when people on different things but no <laughs> sound life advice yeah i feel like sometimes we got to remind people that like if you're on the you're getting on a subway or a train and you see somebody look like that you just turn around and walk back up right just turn around walk back up pull out your phone call somebody um that looks like cataracts. Well, same thing. If somebody looks at you with cataracts like that, turn around, <laughs> walk, walk away, call the police or animal control or something. I don't know. I'm not a doctorologist chat, so I don't know who you would call, but you should call somebody. Okay. Pretty dope. Pretty dope.